G'day guys, well uh, I'm in Mackay at the moment, I did a bit of Google Earthing of the Pioneer River, now a good fisho friend of mine told me that there's uh, heaps of sooty grunter right in the upper reaches and I kept driving around and I found this little place, absolute paradise here and uh, I've got plenty of lures that I can throw around, um, I'm probably going to have to get in the water to get across, you can see just behind me here, it's so clear. I don't know if we can spot sooties, but I'm guessing you can. I've never actually caught one before. I've never fished for one. Anyway, I hope you enjoy this one, guys. Sooty grunter fishing, thanks to Google Earth and a good mate of mine in the middle of nowhere. This is going to be a heap of fun. I'm really looking forward to this. Okay. Getting down might be easy. Getting up. Don't know. Here we go. Whoa. How cool is this terrain? terrain. Do the miles to get the smiles, they say. I reckon this would just be like fishing or similar to the streams in New Zealand for trout. That was quite cold. <laughs> that serves fish. That really does. Okay, let's get some fish. Right there. Sooty Grunter. <gasps> no way. No way. I did it. I did it. It's not big, I guess. Wow. Wow. Look at that. What a beautiful fish. Cool is that? I can just get that right in there. My God, monkeys off my back. There we go. Right under that log. Oh! Oh! Oh my god. I just seen sooties. They just came out. So they're holding in here. Wow. Wow. Okay. There you go, mate. Yeah, all right. I thought I was the only one here. Like, oh, okay. <laughs> so you reckon I could be using the right plastic? Like, you guys prefer white? Oh, any color. Any color. Yeah. Do you do slow wind or? Oh, I let it sink to the bottom and then hop it. Just hop it. All right. I'm gonna throw it and just sit it under that log. I know that sounds crazy. But I'm just wondering if the sooties just sit there, because you can see it dropping off. So I'm gonna try and just sit it in there. There we go. Like that.
Yes, yes. Oh. oh, he's still on. He's still on. Oh. He's still on. Got another sooty, it's a bit bigger. Got him in this scrub, tea bag and it underneath that. Almost almost fishing impossible. But I'm absolutely stoked. And uh, these young boys that I've just met have given me some really cool tips, but you can't beat that. She's a beauty. Got him on that little grub. Just gotta get him back. And just like that, these young, knowledgeable fellas set off on their yaks to find new ground. Well, I'm just working my way back. It's great that I um, bumped into a couple of local boys. I really thought I was the only one, but obviously not. Now I'm a lot more confident fishing around the snags. I wasn't sure at first whether they were in just open water on these rocks or or what but according to the theory sooty should be in there i'll try that oh i just got hit i just got a hit Yep. Rip the tail. Let's try again. So we know there's a sooty in there. Just got to get him. Just got to get it in the right spot. I reckon that's about it. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, baby. <laughs> Look at that. Beast mode. How cool is that? There's another one. Pretty, pretty fish. Wow. What a beautiful fish. See you later. Let's see if there's another one in there. Oh yeah, yo, that was a tap. That was a tap. God, that's close quarters fishing, isn't it? The one more cast is going around these trees or underneath it. close enough there we go that's right underneath yep <sighs> yes yes 
Oh, gee. That theory is just unbelievable. Oh, my God. My God. Look at that. He's only a little guy. But today, I had no sooties to my name. Zero. Zero to my name. Look at that. Wow. That theory pays off. There you go, mate. Let's, um, let's get another one in there. I reckon there's more fish. There we go. I'll let him go right under. Yes! Oh. Oh, there's another one. That's insane. Oh, stop it. Oh, stop it. Is this for real? There's another one. <laughs> So when I first walked up here, I, I didn't even really look at this. But after um, getting my first fish off that snag, and then having a chat with those young little fellas, it's just changed everything. My whole perspective on sooty fishing, I'll tell you what. It's so good. I'd love a monster though. I'm not complaining. Definitely not complaining, so I love hiding in that thick weed by the looks of it. Oh, just got a nip. So there's another one in there. I reckon I've got a little hot spot going now. I'll tell you what, this is wild country. Gee, I mean, before this I had no idea. I wasn't confident at all. I was thinking, am I even going to get one fish? And now it's like, well, how many am I going to get? There you go. Oh, you just hit it. There must be a heap of fish in there. So I'm literally up to my knees and that's it. I'm going to let that go right through. This is going to be dangerous. Yep. Oh, this is decent fish. Oh, that's what we wanted. Oh. Come on. Oh, this is a... What is this? Are you kidding me? Oh no. Freshwater caddy. Oh. Just as I was about to call it a day, I bumped into young Vossi and Jack, and there was no better time to learn a few more tricks from these young local guns. Oh, yeah. yeah, it went up to your, it goes up to your waist. There's barbed wire down here as well. Oh, man, that's getting cold, eh? What you gotta do to get to the spots? Oh yeah, we've, I've done worse than this. <laughs> That deserves a fish. Oh. 
Wow, that's slippery. Oh. Got to be a fish in here. Here we go. Oh, oh I saw that. Oh, you seen it? Yeah, I saw that. Oh, he's he's whack whack the uh, the back off. How cool is this? <laughs> Paradise. No, it's a toad. Oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> good catch, mate. Thank you. Good fish, hold that up. <laughs> Boom. Hope you like this vid, guys. Fishing in a beautiful part of the world. Don't forget to give us a big thumbs up, shoot us a comment and subscribe to Coast Fish TV and we'll catch you next time.